Hey everyone, it's Kavindu here. Today, I'm bringing you a different kind of video than my usual content. I want to share with you how I stumbled into the world of CRPGs and became utterly captivated by Baldur's Gate. Now I promise to keep this short and sweet, so let's dive right in. My journey into the CRPG genre began with a game called Tyranny, which I quite enjoyed. It was my first taste of the genre, and it left me hungry for more. I found myself yearning for classic RPG experiences that would whisk me away to distant lands filled with adventure and mystery. So, armed with curiosity, I took to Google and began my quest for the next gaming gem. I scoured through forums and recommendations until I stumbled upon the legendary Dungeons & Dragons game, Baldur's Gate. Now let me add some context here. I'm from Sri Lanka, where Dungeons & Dragons isn't exactly a household name. So, diving into Baldur's Gate was truly diving into the unknown for me. It was like embarking on a journey to an uncharted land, where every step promised discovery and excitement. With a mix of excitement and apprehension, I thought, what the hell, let's give it a shot. I downloaded and installed the Enhanced Edition, not knowing what to expect. As the game launched and the intro began to unfold, I found myself immediately drawn into its world. The rich storytelling, immersive atmosphere, and captivating visuals had me hooked from the get-go. It was a feeling akin to stumbling upon a hidden treasure chest, a sense of exhilaration mixed with wonder. But it wasn't just the visuals that captivated me, it was the gameplay itself. The real-time with pause combat system provided a unique and engaging experience, allowing me to strategize and adapt to ever-changing situations. And then there were the quests. Oh, the quests! Each one felt like a mini-adventure, meticulously crafted to draw me further into the game world. Whether it was rescuing a kidnapped noble or unraveling the mysteries of a haunted forest, I found myself eagerly exploring every nook and cranny, eager to uncover hidden secrets and reap rich rewards. Curiosity led me down a rabbit hole of discovery, delving deeper into the rich lore of the Dungeons & Dragons universe. I learned that Baldur's Gate is intricately woven into the fabric of the Forgotten Realm setting, a sprawling realm of magic, mystery, and adventure. As I explored further, I uncovered the complexities of the Advanced Dungeons & Dragons 2nd Edition rule set, a system that forms the backbone of the game. Now, despite my lack of understanding about all the nuances of Dungeons & Dragons, it didn't hinder my enjoyment of Baldur's Gate. In fact, it only heightened my appreciation for the game as I marveled at the depth of its world-building and storytelling. From the bustling streets of Baldur's Gate to the treacherous dungeons lurking beneath, every corner of the game was brimming with wonder and excitement. Moreover, Baldur's Gate offered me more than just entertainment. It provided a sense of connection to characters and settings I never knew existed. Despite hailing from a country where D&D is virtually unheard of, I found myself deeply invested in this fantastical world, forging bonds with characters who felt like old friends. It was a testament to the power of storytelling and the universality of human emotions, transcending geographical boundaries and cultural differences. So there you have it. How I got hooked and sunk 15 hours into Baldur's Gate in just one day. And the adventure doesn't end there. I'm diving into all of the Infinity Engine games next. Thank you for joining me on this journey and letting me rant about a classic RPG. Stick around and let's have a blast together. See you in the next one.